Hi everybody, my name is Chris from Reading Town and thank you for joining us today for Junior Times. Now today we're going to talk about the seasons, okay? Let's talk about winter and summer, right? We have both pros and cons. We have good things and bad things. Good thing about the winter, about the winter is we have snow, we have Christmas, but a bad thing will be it's very slippery and it's very dangerous to drive and walk. Good thing about the summer is we can go to the pool and we can go to the beach and you know go to the water park but a bad thing about the summer is that it can be a little too hot and by too hot I mean it kills people it kills plants it kills animals and it could be a big problem right one place that's a big problem is India it's really heating up in India all right, so on May 20, India recorded, or they sort of keeping a check, its hottest day ever in the town of Pallotti with a staggering, staggering means almost you can't move, like very shocking, temperature of 51 degrees Celsius. All right, one more time. In the town of Pallotti, they had 51 degrees Celsius. All right, think about that for a second. In this recent heat wave, heat wave is when it gets very, very staggeringly hot. It has destroyed crops, plants, food, killed livestock, you know, cows, pigs, chickens, and left millions of people without enough water. There's no water, it's too hot. So India is currently in the midst, they're sort of in the middle of a major drought. Drought means there's no water, right? The heat, humidity, humidity is how sticky the air is, how much water vapor is in the air, and lack of water, there's very little, wa little water, lacking of water, is making life difficult, making it very hard to live for the Indian people, right? We take water for granted, but water really, you know, can make or break a person. It can kill you or make you live. The conditions are so extreme, they are so sort of supernatural, they're so mega extreme super that even the asphalt roads have began to melt. How hot is it? How extreme is the temperature? The asphalt, meaning on the roads where cars drive, the black road, it is melting like ice, right? In 1913, the highest temperature on Earth, right, ever on Earth, was recorded at 56.7 degrees Celsius in Death Valley, California, right? This is just anywhere on Earth. This is a long time ago. Although this was over 100 years ago since then, global average temperatures have spiked at an alarming rate. Alarming rate means a very scary speed. It's going up. These spikes are coming faster, right, at a very alarming speed. The global average temperature in 1913 was negative 0.33 degrees, right? So we're talking about average, uh, the Pyongyun. But now in 2013, the current temperature sits at 0.87 degrees. So we can see it's a big difference because we're talking about the average, not just one day, but all the days together in one average. Uh, it's a lot hotter now. Normally, the summer days in the western region, the western area part of India, average temperatures between 32 to 40 degrees, right? That's the average. But with dangerously increasing temperatures every year, it's going up every year, and severe signs of global climate change. It is likely that hotter days are to come. It's a scary sentence right here, right? This global climate change is not only going to you know, affect India, it will affect you, me, it will affect all of the world, right? It's a very serious problem. Okay, A, we have three review questions here. How does the recent heat wave in India, the recent heat wave is the very high temperatures, right? In India, affect or sort of change people's lives there. How are their, how is their life different after all this heat? The heat wave has caused severe water shortages, 
blank livestock and destroyed crops. So we're saying severe water shortage. There's very little water, destroyed or you know killed crops, and livestock. Do you think the livestock got healthier or they got sicker? Well, they got all sicker, so we can guess that the livestock will also get sick, but even worse, they were killed. Right? They had no chance. B. What happened to global average temperatures since 1913? The temperature blanked at an alarming rate. So at 1913, the average temperature was negative 80 something degrees, but the temperature is not going down, it's not getting colder. The temperature is going up and it's getting hotter, right? And this up motion, right? How do we say what this motion is? It is increased. So when some, a number is increasing, it is going up, if it is decreasing, it is going down, right? But unfortunately, it's increasing. C. When was the highest temperature on Earth recorded? So this is in all of Earth's written history, right? The highest temperature was recorded about 100 years blank in Death Valley, California. So this time here, 100 years, we're not talking 100 years later. We're talking about the the past, right? This was in 1913, I think. So in the past, another way to say in the past was ago. So we use a time and ago to say in before. So one hour ago, I ate lunch. Two days ago, I went to Emart. Okay? We have three review terms here. A. The heat, humidity, the stickiness, and lack of water is making life blank for the Indian people. So because of all these problems, right, it's very hot, very sticky, there's no water, right? Is it easy for the Indian people to live? Are they having a good time? No, they're very, having a very horrible time. They're suffering, right? They're in a lot of trouble. So they are having a very difficult time. It's making life not easy, it's making life harder. It's making life more difficult. B. The conditions are so blank that even the asphalt roads have begun to melt. The asphalt roads are the roads where the cars drive, right? The black roads. And they don't melt unless they only melt when the Temperature is super, mega, ultra, extreme, right? So extreme, we're talking about like that's so far left or so far right. Extreme cold, like super, 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 super cold, extreme cold will be in the space. And extreme heat, super, super hot will be in the sun or in this case on earth. Right? C. Normally, summer days in the western blank of India average temperatures between uh, 32 to 40 degrees. So, we're talking about the west. So, this is the, from where you're looking, this is north, south, east, and this is the west, right? So, they're talking about not all of India, but only this little part or this little area, zone, we can say a region. So the region is talking about a space or um, an area or just the location of some place. Right? So to review, difficult means to not make it easy to, but make it harder. Extreme means it's super super this way or super super this way. Right? It just means that it's a very high degree of something. And region, we're talking about an area of a particular place. We can say the Gwangwon-do region or the Songpa-gu region. We're talking about just one little space. All right? So next time, you know, we drink our waters and we go to the beach, think about the other people in the world that don't have water like you and I, that don't have air conditioning like you and I. All right? Let's always be thankful. Uh, so thank you for joining us for Junior Times. My name is Chris from Reading Town. I'll see you next time.